See this mist coming out of my diffuser? More importantly, can you smell it? Heavenly. Well, what I'm doing is diffusing essential oils. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do it and why you wanna do it. Have you ever walked into a room and it just reeked of artificial fragrance? Maybe they have plugins in their house or they just sprayed some air freshener. Um, well, just recently, Michael and I stayed at a place that had those plugins, and after a couple of nights, our lungs literally started to hurt. That stuff is nasty, okay? It's, they're loaded with chemicals, they can even be carcinogens, so you just want to stay away from plugins, incense, cheap candles, air fresheners, no, no, no. But having said that, it is nice to smell good, right? Or to walk into the room and not have it smell like trash or diaper pail. And that's really where aromatherapy can come in. Um, as Mama Natural, I love using anything that is natural. And that's why I absolutely love my diffuser. And that's what this is, a diffuser. Uh, now what this machine does is it breaks apart your essential oil into tiny little molecules that will fill your room with this incredible therapeutic aroma. You can find diffusers on amazon.com starting around $20. The one I have right here is from Young Living because I use their products for all things essential oils. And now I'm gonna show you how to use it. So what you're gonna do is find your diffusers basin and you're gonna add water. Now some will say to use tap, others will say to use distilled, just follow the instructions. And now that you've got your water in there, you add your essential oil. So if you're new to oils, I would recommend starting with just two drops. Um, this is also a great number if you have children nearby and be sure that you're using safe, gentle oils. Um, if you're more seasoned, you can use five drops and beyond. So it's really a personal thing. Experiment, see what works for you. I like to do four or five drops. Now I just put on my lid plug it in, start it up, and voila, you're diffusing. Now the reason why I love diffusing the most is because it's the easiest way to experience aromatherapy. Yes, there's actually a therapeutic quality to diffusing these oils. And that's because when we smell these oils, they can reach parts of our brain that no other sense can. Um, so it can help support your physical well-being, your emotional well-being, and even your spirituality. And of course, what I love is because it neutralizes odor in a natural and safe way. So some of the oils that I really love to diffuse are, in the morning, peppermint and lemon. These are just great wake-me-up oils. They help me start my day before my kids get up, and they smell delicious together. I also love frankincense. This is great if I'm doing Bible study or just kind of reflecting or in a bubble bath. It's really calming and it really grounds me. Myrrh and sandalwood are also wonderful oils for spirituality. If I need a mood boost, I love grapefruit. It's fresh, clean, and it just makes me feel happy. Orange is another great oil to try as well. And then of course, at night, to kind of calm the whole family down, I love to use lavender. Um, Young Living also makes an oil blend called Peace and Calming, which is one of my favorites. And cedarwood is another great relaxing oil. And when it comes to neutralizing nasty odors, nothing works as well as purification. This is an oil blend that has citronella, rosemary, lavender, and it just smells awesome. And literally, I cannot smell those bad smells. Like it neutralizes Paloma's diaper pail, it's stinky trashes, it's phenomenal. But really the options are endless. And that's what I love about essential oils. There are so many different kinds. Um, so play with them, have some great variety and find the oils that really speak to you. If you're interested in learning more about essential oils, I have a free gift for you, a download. All you have to do is click on the link below and it's 88 ways to use essential oils in your daily life from cleaning to relaxation to mood. So be sure to check it out. And now I would love to hear from you. Do you use essential oils? Do you like to diffuse? And which are your favorite oils to diffuse? Share with me in the comments below.